Let's talk about a common issue with input in Godot. We have a student who made a weapon that just works, as you can see, and then there's another, when you click, it doesn't shoot. But this problem only occurs in the full game with the enemies and the user interface. If we go to the test room, which has less elements, and we use the weapon, it works no problem. The problem is that the user interface is getting in the way. So we have a pause menu and on screen heads up display in this project, and it is catching the click events. Let's check uh, the weapons to see what's happening in the code. So this is the fire weapon that works. And you can see that the input is being checked in physics process. So when you do that, when you call input dot is action pressed, it's going to pull the key. And it's going to tell you if the key is pressed or not, basically. So it works at any time, even with user interface. But if I go to the ice spell, which you can see uh, here, and I go to the code, this time, it's not using physics process, it's using unhandled input. And then we check if the event that we get when the function gets called is pressed. When you use this input system, it's designed so that if the player clicks on a button in the user interface, the game doesn't receive this event, it stops at the button because you don't want, for example, to click a button in the pause menu, and that to cause the player to shoot in the game behind the menu. So how do you solve this? Well, the first way is to use the process or physics process function and to pull for input using input dot is action just press and you can then check if the player clicked this frame. Now if you want to keep the system with unhandled input so that if the player clicks a button in a menu, it's not going to shoot through the menu, you have to go to your user interface. So I'll go to my main game scene where we have a pause screen and an on screen UI. And if I select the on screen UI and expand the mouse category in the inspector, you can see that filter is set to stop. What this means is this frame, the bounding box of my whole user interface is stopping mouse clicks. So I want to change that to ignore to ignore mouse clicks. And actually, I want to go into my on screen UI scene, select all the nodes in there in my scene doc. And then in the inspector, go to mouse filter and make sure that everything is set to ignore. Some nodes in Godot by default will be set to automatically block mouse clicks because typically when you open a menu, you don't want to click through the menu. Uh, but there are exceptions like your heads up display. And now if I play the game, I'm going to go loot the weapon. And you can see I'm able to fire like normal. Subscribe to the channel for more questions and answers about Godot and game development. We have new videos coming out constantly. If you have any questions we can answer in less than five minutes, please ask in the comments below. With that, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.